As President, I'll defend our environment. I'll defend our workers and our cherished way of life. Last month, I signed the Great American Outdoors Act, the most significant investment in our national parks in over a century since Teddy Roosevelt. Teddy Roosevelt. But it's true. Number one since Teddy Roosevelt. Who would have thought? Trump is the great environmentalist. Do you hear that, Ed? Do you hear that? That's good. And I am. I am. I believe strongly in it. Through this legislation, we're providing nearly $10 billion for long-delayed maintenance projects in our national parks. And Florida has helped as much as anybody and maybe more. My administration has fully or partially cleaned up 61 EPA Superfund pollution sites that were rotting all over our country, far more than Obama and Biden, no matter how far you go back, more than any administration. Since my inauguration, we've recovered more endangered or threatened species than any other administration has accomplished in its first term. Earlier this year, I announced that the United States would join the One Trillion Trees Initiative. We already have one billion trees pledged to be planted, and it's moving very rapidly. We've opened land and expanded access to over four million acres of public lands for hunting and fishing, including over 200,000 acres in Florida. My sons will be very happy to hear that. As the last administration pursued its globalist agenda abroad, they were all over the place. They were everywhere but here in our country. They were taking care of other lands, you, countries that you never heard of they were taking care of. And they didn't do a good job there either. They neglected the fundamentals of public health right here in the United States, right here in our home. My administration is focused on ensuring crystal clean air and water, under my administration, we've seen a significant drop in air pollution since 2017, a very significant drop for the first time in nearly 30 years. 